Hello, good afternoon to everybody. Welcome back to my humble kitchen. This is Lizelle. So now today uh, I am cooking our lunch. So I am cooking, the, we call the dish is uh, paksiw. Paksiw na pata. The pata means is a fork, uh, fork legs. So this is what it looks like. Uh, this is the pork uh, uh, meat leg. I already boiled this while I am not here at home and I just leave it in a low fire and then it's uh, uh, it's tender now and then I save I save the uh, the stock the fork stock uh, just in case uh, yes I need to have a sauce to make uh, you know in the dish So I'm going to introduce more my ingredients. So for my paksiw ni pata, I am going to use uh, banana. Uh, I don't know what you call this. It's, we call this uh, bulaklak ng saging in Tagalog. But this is a part of banana. As you can see, this is a uh, banana bars in heart inside. I don't know guys just check what what is this you can search it you can search it and google it on youtube so that you will know about this and i will write in my description below what is this the bulaklak and then i am adding a bay leaf on my taxi na pata and i have of course uh peppercorns crushed pepper and uh secret of uh, you know of my dish every day I am using this so so I know everybody know what is this and then in here in project me I have my onions and uh, garlic so I already opened the stove I'm going to put uh, now my onions in here in my pot in my pan So hope you guys, uh, you can try these dishes. This is one of the Filipino fish here in the Philippines. So I'm just saying my onions now. Of course, I have. Uh, I'm cooking my rice as well for our lunch. So now that I am saying, I am saying my onions. So how are you? How is everybody? Today is Friday. Mm, it's so hot outside. The heat is deadly on outside. I was just take a walk and uh, uh, getting some more stuff from the market, and it was just a quick, you know, uh, because it was so hot. I don't like to. I don't like to walk in the middle of heat, you know. I make sure that I, I still come home early, going back early. So now I am putting my onions and I am adding my uh, garlic in here in my pan. Oh, by the way, <laughs> I am using uh, uh, vinegar and uh, soy sauce here in my paksiw na pata so i just put all my ingredients in here and i make sure these are all my ingredients and i make sure everything what i use here in my dish is i always include in my down description below i write down in my description below so you guys you will not miss for those who want to try to cook this uh, paksiw na pata uh, I'm sure you will love it. Just check, you know, all the ingredients that I have in my description. So, going, <laughs> moving on. In my bag, I am sauteing my garlic and onion. So, there. Okay. 
so I'm cooking my rice as well. Uh, I think I'm <laughs> to add some more water in my rice. So guys, that is the way I am cooking the rice. So make sure that it was low fire. So still sauteing our onion and garlic. So welcome to my kitchen once again. <laughs> so now that our onion is getting more transparent now and I think the garlic is okay to put something in here, I am going to put our main ingredients in my paksiw na pata. So this is the pork leg. I already boiled it and saved the broth. I'll put it in here. So there. So this is the pork pork leg. Yeah. Uh, here in the Philippines we eat the pork leg. I don't know in every part in some country if they are having a pork a pork leg very good you have so much different kinds of dish that you can use a pork leg so yeah now I'm going to season some pepper crack pepper yeah. and I'm going to put uh, my laurel leaf here so there and now uh, I'm going to put the bulaklak ng saging or the oh my god I need to search what is the English of this Oh, whatever, I just put the blaklak ng saging. Uh, this is came from the banana heart. So I'm going to put it in here. I already washed. So now, I am going uh, to put uh, some soy sauce. I think I'll just put three tablespoons of soy sauce. I'll make it four tablespoons. Five. So yeah, I put five tablespoons of soy sauce. And I am going to put some uh, pork broth. So there. And now I'm going to put some uh, vinegar, uh, three, three or two tablespoons of vinegar. So there. Oh, got this one. And I forget that I need to add some sugar in here. So I'm going to take some sugar here in the fridge. So yeah, this is the day going. And uh, I, I didn't make a... Um, I didn't make donut today because I am thinking to make it for tomorrow morning. So I have, I'm 
going to add some uh, one tablespoon of sugar in here in this just to have you know a balanced taste because I used uh, vinegar in here I put some vinegar so this toxina butter it's kind of like a sweet and sour taste so those so those who know the adobo, it's the same like adobo dish, but we just called it a paksiu na pata. So this is the, so this is the dish look like. So there, and uh, I will just let it simmer for like a 10 minutes. So. Uh, I'm going to put the cover in here. In my so there is the dishes. We are waiting, you know. Uh, we are in a boiling part now. So how are you everybody? I hope you guys you enjoy watching my last video I made. Which is um, uh, I make a donut. And I share uh, my new big boy, the family. <laughs> The donut cutter I, if I remember I share how to use it and I was really enjoying it and thank you for the love of my life you always provide thing for me to use uh, who know who you are I love you <laughs> and for those 1 million subscriber over there I will say thank you for continuing watching my video even though I didn't make a lot these past few days but I make sure that you know every time I do something you know I try to make a video and upload it in YouTube and uh, so yeah that it's for the day so moving on in our dish still waiting it's boiling part so guys Kirby is uh, doing well now and he is uh, he is in a long resting, not in a bed rest. He can sit and eat now, and he just eat too much because after he after the sickness, and uh, and our subdivision here in our village is still locked down. Just in here, you know, we, we just cannot go in the other shortcut way. We just passing in and out, you know, in our main gate in the subdivision. So all the shortcut we cannot use it. Uh, right there, you know, the shortcut of my mom's, it's already closed. So it's too hard and it's too, uh, it really takes time uh, to come out in a, in, a, in a shortcut, which is uh, pretty easy, you know, to go in there in the shortcut because you just walk and just grab a jeepney there in the bus. But now we cannot do that anymore, so we cannot use the shortcut. So we, all of the people here are passing in and out using the main gate in the subdivision so the dish is boiling i think it's not 10 minutes but i want to take a look oh yeah it is boiling so, let me get some love in my dish just stirring stuff stirring so yeah and now i'm going to put the I'm making noise. I'm going to put some um, seasoning here in my dish. So, so I know for I know those countries and uh, places you can you can get and grab some of this seasoning, but I'm not going to mention like I said. And I'm sure all the people that you watching the video know what is this. So yeah, I just put one pouch. Just to have a taste. So yeah. So like I said, I already boiled the the meat or the pork meat that I am using here in Pasiu na pata. So yeah, we just keep on boiling and cover it again. So then. So that is the day going. Uh, I have some dishes waiting over there to wash, but later I'm going to wash them. And now, so.
Oh, we still have rice as well. And it's about to cook. So yeah, actually it's already cooked. So I'm going to turn out the fire in my rice. So it's in boiling. So this is our kitchen. This is our humble kitchen. We just have a, you know, a tiny kitchen, but it's a, but it's a decent kitchen. So this the kitchen looks like. <laughs> There and this is the stove. Put you over there. I'm going to check our dishes. So I think I'm not having a hard time to boil the meat because it's already tender, like I said. So just give it some love by stirring. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm going to try and taste my dishes, but. Let's go. I'm going to take the spoon and over there. So I'm going to put you there again. Oh, lost you for a moment. So this is the final prediction. I'm going to taste my dish. Hmm. Oh, it is good for me. And I think I'm going to add some uh, one tablespoon of sugar because I wanted to have a balanced taste, sweet and sour taste. So there. So the dish is almost done. We're just waiting to get some uh, to dry some more the water. You know what I mean? Because I didn't uh, put a lot of uh, pork broth, but you know, uh, this is not should be like a uh, this is not a soup. So I just wanted to dry a little bit so that you know we we want to have not so thickened. Uh, sauce or water in here in our dish let me give some love again by stirring so yeah and I'm going to taste it again oh yeah it's good finally uh, I made it so I like the taste, I like the, the I like the combination of sweet and sour and salty, not so much salty. So this is it. Let's boil like a two minutes. So the dish is done. It's almost done. So once again I am saying Thank you again, you know, for those watching my video and I am so thankful that I get a chance to share uh, some dishes this afternoon. And so yeah, that's it. That is our supper. And I think it's enough for, you know, to eat it, you know, until dinner. So we just have leftover for dinner. So yeah, like I said, the dish is almost done and uh, I think I am going to plating to show all of you what is Aksiw uh, Napata look like. So there, I have this uh, aluminum plate. <laughs> I am going to plating, you know, my dish in here. So yeah, this is the pan, this is the pax, this is the looks like a paxiu na pata.
So let me introduce my paksiu na pata. This is the paksiu na pata looks like. There you have it. I hope you enjoy watching my video and I hope uh, someday you will try these dishes. And if you are home, why don't you grab some pork meat and you know, try to make it. So this is the paksiu na pata. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy your day with your family and loved one. Enjoy cooking at your home when you are home. And uh, uh, I hope everybody is spending time the rest of the day with the family and the kids and the friends. And for those who, who are going to work, please take care at work. And uh, have a good day and night to everybody. Thank you for watching. See you in my next other vlog.